guys, I've got a problem. Lots of problems, according to my wife. But a real first world problem. I've got an old dual trigon tank. The lids are black. The light doesn't get to the corners. So what else can I do? Make a see-through lid. This is definitely going to be one of those things that you didn't know you needed. You probably might not need it anyway. But watch the video. See how it turns out. So please subscribe. I've got a lot of viewers who are just watching and not subscribing. It goes such a long way to help me. Thanks very much. Enjoy the video and let me know what you think in the comments. So here's my first world problem. As you can see, really old um, style Trigon tank. Um, lots of the old style have these lids. The corners are just so dark. The floating plants don't get enough light and the plants in the corners don't, especially at the back. So the plan is make a see-through lid and I can put an external light above to help the plants grow up and towards the back. So here's the plan. These are the old lids for the dual uh, Trigon 190. And I want to use them as a template and cut them out using Perspex, which will hopefully allow more light to go to the floating plants and more light in general to the, the rest of the plants. If you know the dual trigon, the way the lights are, they have quite a thick strip in the middle and it blocks light going to certain parts of the tank. And I just thought this might be a good way to fix it. Okay, let's give it a go. Start by taking all the bits out of the lid. Um, let's go with the corner shape one first. Should already be nice and straight. And then we'll just have to do that. I, I'm not going to do that bit yet. I'm not going to cut out the circles or these bits. I'll try and do those at the end. Grab a pen. There we go. And I'm going to use the spirit level. Score this gently. I think we're about ready to give that another go. Work this time, which is good. That's one bit. This one's going to be a bit, bit more tricky. Definitely is not a masterclass on how to use tools. Oh, that's for sure. My dad would not, <laughs> not be pleased. Luckily, they're my tools now, not his. So, uh, you won't really like them. There we are. Uh, a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be. We got there in the end. So let's uh, get to the finer details. In the corners, same as before. We're just going to chop there, there, and then we chop down there as well. Perfect. This time. What I'm going to do on this one, piece of sandpaper. It's only, only really an advantage if you've got old style tanks, most of the new tanks have got glass lids or no lids at all. I just don't want the, the extra condensation in my in my front room on this one. Now for the best bit, a bit of ASMR for you. We do it in one go. Oh lovely. Other side. Oh. Here 
There we go, that's the one bit. Put that to one side. Uh, same thing to the other bit. that makes the cool noise. Right, there we are. That's the other bit. We're head inside and put it on the tank. Okay, moment of truth. Will it fit? I haven't tried it out yet. Let's slot that in there. Is it going to fit? Yeah, just wiggle that. Oh, it's looking good. Oh, perfect. Like an absolute glove. Already looks better. Look how much extra light. I like the fact you can see through to it, actually. It's quite nice. I just need to put a little handle on this one. There we go. It's just an old furniture coaster. That I had lying around. Thought that would do the job. Let's see if this one fits. This one uh, I'm not so confident about, but we'll give it a try. Wiggle, wiggle that in. Oh, excellent. Like a professional. There we go. I mean, it, you can already see it looks brighter in the corners. The float plant has got more lights, and I'm going to get a, a light to go above it for ambient light. I just really want the plants in the back corner to grow up towards the back rather than to the centre and spread the light out. Yeah, all in all, uh, a success. Like I say, definitely didn't need it, but it's all about experimenting. Really enjoyed it. Please comment below, like and subscribe. Take care. See you on the next one.